It's still pretty loud. What up you guys? Welcome to yet another Daily Driven Exotics vlog. Wifey and I are on BC Ferries. We're heading over to Vancouver. We have a special day planned with McLaren, which I'm super excited about. And I get to spend some time with this beautiful woman. Hungry? Are we going for, look at your hair. Your hair is all over. You go ahead. <laughs> That's why it says high wind area. Yep. All right, BC Ferries, limited food options. This is not gonna be a food vlog. I'm not food vlogging BC Ferries food. It's like chicken strips or fries, burger or fries. No chicken chips. Poutine, they have poutine, very Canadian. But we'll be on the mainland very shortly, you guys. I'm super excited to see what kind of car they got for us. I told them bright. I like bright colors. We are pulling into Horseshoe Bay and then we get to drive into Vancouver. Whoa, the boat is like leaning back and forth. The boat's like rocking. I'm trying to talk. Check these out, you guys. We're gonna drop these soon. It's a five amp battery pack. Charges your phone ultra fast, all branded. Daily Driven Exotics with our track logo on it. We're gonna have some new ones with the new logo soon. Stay tuned, they're not in the store yet. I'll let you know when they drop. Well, we have left the ferry. We got about a 30 minute drive into Vancouver. We're gonna go drop off all the luggage, drop off the vehicle, jump in a cab, or grab the, the house car. They have a house car at this hotel. Have we stayed at this hotel before? Yeah, it's fun. Oh yeah, they have a house car. Go over to McLaren and find out what they have waiting for us. Now, I said bright colors, so I don't know. Blue, green, purple, who knows? Hey, how crazy would it be if it was orange, like my new wheels? I'm on a bit of an orange kick. I'm gonna put it out there. Law of attraction, they're gonna give me an orange car. I really have no idea. See you guys in a second. Little montage going into Vancouver. Vancouver, by the way, is one of our personal during summertime favorite places to visit because it's so diverse. I mean, you have the mountains, you have the ocean, they have amazing restaurants, and we're gonna show you guys as much of it as we can. So stay tuned. McLaren of Vancouver, just over on Burrard and Second. And we've arrived. Welcome to McLaren, Vancouver. We're gonna go inside, say hi to the crew, and see what they have in store for us. Oh, there's the man right there. Good, how are you, sir? Good to see you. Look at this beautiful showroom. How you doing, brother? How's it going? Pleasure, hey, great, pleasure great. Pleasure to meet you. Hi, this is my wife. Lovely to meet you. Nice to pleasure, how are you today? It's like Skittles in here, I love this. Look at this thing, here. This, this thing, have you driven this? I have driven one. I've driven this one, but I've driven one, yeah. Crazy. What a beast, right? Fast, yeah, fast. Track, just track crazy. I know, track crazy. I love this vehicle. It's and the spider. Look at this, I like orange seat belts. Okay, sir. What? Do you have in store? So these guys are doing like a, it's a monthly, right? Yeah. Monthly by monthly, they're exactly. deciding. But cars and coffee, which is huge, because in Vancouver, the whole supercar community really needs this. So I'm grateful that you guys are yeah. putting something on. But you guys are making an effort to really pull everybody together, especially with your clients, and give them something fun to do with these beautiful cars. So uh, this afternoon. There is a 650 for you. So we'll bring you around here. I think the guys are just checking the tire pressure on her. That's always good. So yeah. I just put those new wheels on my car and went to drive it away and the tire pressure wasn't good. 
and I almost, I almost drove on a flat tire. So I'm glad that uh, you guys are checking the tires. Yeah. So here, I won't film in here because this is the this is like the maintenance bay, and there's customers' cars in here. So when we pull the car out, I'll show you. Okay, you guys, we have a key to a McLaren from McLaren of Vancouver. Huge thank you to Sean and Morris and everybody who set this up for us. See, we were coming over for cars and coffee, thought we would just hang out for the day and then show up tomorrow and they were gonna give us the 720, but then they surprised us and said, no, we got a car for you Friday as well. And without further ado, look at how beautiful she is. This is a Taraco Orange 650S Spider and done in this amazing, just simple gloss black wheel. And uh, well, wifey, it's a sunny day. You ready to hit the Vancouver area in top down condition? So right here, should be a little button. And I you know, you got I the doors. This. You got the doors that go up now. Oh, I got doors that go up and be already. Let's put some heat in the engine, you guys, and just hit the streets of Vancouver and have just a ton of fun. What a beautiful day to be out here and really sharing my local area with you guys because you see so much of the Los Angeles area, Beverly Hills, Rodeo, and all those shenanigans. It's time to have a little bit of fun and with my wifey. Let's just get in this car and enjoy it. Oh, twin turbo V8. Oh yeah. Okay guys, the first thing you need to know about the McLaren 650S is this car right now is an absolute steal for the money. It has got all the tech in it. Unlike the 570, this car has the very, very well-known McLaren hydraulic suspension setting that is super sporty, but also very comfortable. Now we've taken a few 650s out in the past, and this is a car that you liked quite a bit. Is that the green one? Yes, it was Mantis Green is what it's called. Beautiful car. So, McLaren. They have some fun little controls right here. Right now we're in sport, but what we wanna hit is, I don't like to drive in, um, see that A up there? That means we're in automatic. We're not gonna drive in automatic. I'm gonna go with manual. And we wanna do all the aero. And this, launch, no. Launch, no, no, wifey, don't touch launch. <laughs> don't touch launch. We're not, launch we're not gonna launch right out of the dealership. We might never get a car again. The cool thing too is these paddles, you can shift with one hand. So you can pull back or push forward to go down. And on this side, you can do the same thing. It's just the opposite. Ready to hit the streets? Yeah. Let's, Let's do it. So wifey wanted to do like get some AC going. Another cool feature of this car, just before we pull out of the dealership is, it has dual climate control and everything is on either door. So she can control her temperatures and airflow and everything from the right side of the door. And I can do mine from right here. It just makes it super convenient. Yeah, 570 right there. McLaren's on McLaren's. McLaren's on McLaren's, yes. All right, here we go. What do you think, wifey? It's fun. <laughs> what do you mean the bridge is too narrow? The bridge is fine. Oh my god, just watch the road. <laughs> okay. Thoughts on comfort? Super comfortable. Like comfortable enough we can buy this car? I'm a big fan of the turbo sounds, like, listen. That's all you can it's hear. It's much quieter than the Lambo that we ride. Straight pipe Lambo. Yeah! And I know what that is. V12 straight pipe Lambo is definitely going to be louder. Thank you. Appreciate yeah. It. All right. We got Enjoy the. Lunch. We will. Thank you, Craig. We got the 458 and a 570. Oh, and a GTS. But at the end of the day, 
I'll take the Taraco Orange 650S over any of those cars. We're having a blast. Yeah. Top down, but we're starving. So and when, my, when I get low blood sugar? Hangry. Hangry. All right. Quick little bite to eat at Cactus Club. Delicious. So good. We're going to catch up later and do something for dinner. But that was just to tide us over when we go and explore Vancouver and show you guys some of the beautiful places to come and visit if you come here. First and foremost, right here where we are is what's considered Coal Harbor. And Coal Harbor is where you always see me in my vlogs flying in on either the seaplanes or those helicopters. And a couple of cool things to see is back in 2010 when we had the Winter Olympics, that was our Olympic torches. Um, we've got a really cool digital whale sitting over here. So let me guys give you, let me give you guys a little montage. Okay, quick little lesson about Vancouver. This is the convention center. This is where the Vancouver International Auto Show went down. You probably saw it if you've been with, like basically with the channel for a while. That over the water is North Vancouver. That over on the other side of that bridge we went over called the Lionsgate Bridge. And by the way, we're gonna go check out that nice beautiful park, that's Stanley Park. But on the other side of all that, all those homes on the hill, that's West Vancouver. Now look, don't hear me that all of Vancouver isn't expensive. All of Vancouver is expensive. But West Vancouver, that's where the real expensive is. Like 20 plus million dollar homes, absolutely insane, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. This is all downtown Vancouver, and uh, this is where a lot of the action goes down. There's a lot of fun stuff to do here. Vancouver is a beautiful place for a couple of reasons. One, you've got the urban lifestyle, but then you have all this untouched mountains. We have Whistler only a couple hour drive away. Enough of me rambling on. I think this is a great city. You might be wondering, why do I not film more here if it's so amazing? Well, the supercar culture is just not the same as Los Angeles. I mean, nothing really is. LA, Orange County is like the Mecca. Um, however, there are a ton of incredible super and hyper cars here in Vancouver. Here's what I'm begging. I'm begging all the people here in Vancouver reach out to me because if you want to go do stuff, I will go do stuff with you. I just don't have a crew to go roll with and I'm not going to roll by myself. So all you got to do is drop an email to info at dailydrivenexotics.com. Say you want to do something and we'll organize something when I'm in town. I'll even bring my car back. Okay guys, this is my friend Craig. Craig, say hello. Hello. And uh, yeah, I come to the Fairmont um, Pacific Rim. There's three Fairmont locations in this city. There's the Hotel Vancouver, the oldest one. This is the newest and kind of in the middle is the waterfront just up the road. So these gentlemen and I have known each other for quite some time and they they know how to drive everything. They get way fancier stuff than what I've ever owned. I don't know about that. Yes, it's true. It's true. Thank you for watching the car. <laughs> Always. You gotta bring it around? Look at this guy. That, that's the best part of the job. You called it. I knew it was Gene That was Gene Simmons right there. I kind of like yelled at him and said, Gene, you're the man. And what did he say? He's gonna be like very oh, he doesn't, he doesn't want to be seen. But it was very obvious that it was him. It was pretty cool that he yelled out, you're the man too. All right, we got the McLaren. Here we go. 650S action coming to you from Vancouver. Ready to go, wifey? I'm ready. All right. Craig, thank you. Always. Damon. Um, Pleasure, buddy. That was kind of rad. Gene Simmons just walked in. Pretty wild, eh? Um. And we are off. Oh, you had a point of something you wanted to say about this hotel before we left. I think that it's like the most beautiful hotel. The most beautiful? Yeah. I would agree. I think so. And Fairmont, you know, it doesn't matter who you are. They just treat you like incredible. Okay, guys, Stanley Park coming right up. Next on the tour list. So from Stanley Park, you get this amazing view. We're directly on the opposite side of where we were before. And uh, yeah, you can see the convention center right over there. That's where we were standing before. So 
listen, if you guys are gonna come here, you gotta come check this out. Here's a fun fact about Stanley Park. You know the NHL, hockey? Well, all the teams play for a cup called the Stanley Cup by Lord Stanley. That's what this park's named after, Stanley Park. So, same dude. One's a cup and one's a bunch of trees. I really don't know what they have in common, but apparently the dude was pretty popular. And a great view of the Lionsgate Bridge. All right, wifey, where are we gonna go now? You had an idea. What was on your list? Granville Island. Granville Island. Off to Granville Island, guys. Congratulations. Uh, the park's huge. It's a big loop. It's a one-way uh, road. A lot of cyclists, a lot of cars, a lot of horses. And uh, our Vancouver Aquarium is inside the park. So if you come and you want to go check out like the fish, the fish are at the aquarium, man. Okay. I don't think it is. Maybe it was at one time. <laughs> they connected it. I don't know the history. Google it. Anyhow, all I know is they have a market here, which we're trying to find parking. They had a 458, and they have the best donut shop. Now, I can't eat donuts, but I'm going to make wifey one. It's like Transformers. Transformers really do need to get a McLaren. <laughs> well, I'm a little this way, he's a little this way, so it's toint. Okay guys, here's where you gotta come. The public market, right down here, is Lee's Donuts. Oh, pow. Lee's Donuts. Oh, Hi there. the massive apple fritter. Now I used to eat one of these. Probably why I got fat. You would eat now I'm on a thing. diet, I ate too many of these massive fritters. Wait until you guys see how big this is. You would have eaten this is no joke. I would have eaten one of these to myself. Oh go. my gosh. It doesn't even fit in the box. Look at that. <laughs> okay, whenever you're ready, you let me know. I don't want to walk just walk down the street with it. Why not? That'd be funnier. Everybody be looking. It'd be more obvious than like driving a supercar down the road. Just oh this hot girl with this big fritter. Okay, two-hander. Okay, here you go. Dun 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 dun. Oh my god. Okay, hold on here. This is like, they're so good, but they're so good. Like I would. It's excessive. I it's thought, just funny. I would rather <laughs> just break a piece off. <laughs> you know, you gotta hold it up. Oh my god. Now you don't even get the box's protection. <laughs> Holy. C it's so good. Thank you, guys. Comment yeah. comment below. <laughs> Wifey's a trooper. We came, we saw, she conquered oh my God. <laughs> the apple fritter. She actually ate way more of it than I thought she would <laughs> off camera. <laughs> so now we're gonna go and have a quick visit with a good friend of mine, Gabe. You guys have probably seen Gabe, again, if you're long-term subscribers, Gabe has a company called Seven Figure Entrepreneur. He does a lot of like online marketing kind of uh, interviews with successful people who make seven figures or more in that um, industry. And so we're gonna go meet him. He has, he's like the fountain of knowledge when it comes to, uh, I think, success tips because he interviews so many people who do so well. But I don't know if he's got any tips for you or not. We're just gonna go say hi because he's a good friend of mine and he's super hilarious. And my wife and his wife know each other but they never get to get together. She's actually in town. Hey guys, 
we're gonna attempt rolling the roof down while moving. I think you can do it at speed, go. Oh, something's happening. Something's happening. Some, oh, something's oh happening. I think a little bit of wind helps it. That's cool though, look at this. Right? Okay, that was cool. Hey you guys, we got Gabe What's back up, in the vlog from Seven Figure Entrepreneur, yeah. which is on Instagram. Give at, him a follow. At Seven Figure ENTP. And it's, is it spelt seven? Uh, or it's the, the number? Number seven. Okay, that's. Made it real easy. Yeah. Yeah, real There'll easy. There'll be a link in description. That's yes. even easier. That's even easier. So Gabe likes cars. What do you think of the uh, 650S, bro? It's mean, man. It looks good. And I like the orange. It's very poppy. Taraco orange from McLaren. They have multiple that's, oranges. That's not as hard to understand as a Lamborghini orange, which is great. Oh yeah, yeah some Italian word that I could yeah. never pronounce with a lisp. The English people make it easy. They do. Yeah. But I mean, look at this interior. That's an amazing spec. Yeah. All Alcantara, carbon fiber pack on that too. Everything, hey? Yeah, orange sports stitching. Yeah. Um, you got the pit, like the uh, piping on the, on the yeah. uh, plain black, but you can get these in different colors. So this has got like full carbon. Yeah. Carbon front end, carbon mirrors, carbon side skirts, carbon, is that called a blade? Air, air blade? Nice. Air I don't know. intake blade? Intake blade. Intake blade, yes, let's um, see that. And the one thing, I don't know why, but <laughs> this takes me all the way back to being like my first car and broke. Yeah. And you want to do mods to your car. What was your first car when you were broke? Uh, an Acura Integra, 1994 RS. Ooh. Yeah, not a GSR or anything fancy. I had a Ford Thunderbird that was like hammered with yeah. two 12 inch subs in the back and it was so loud. <laughs> it was so loud. So loud. Anyway, moving on. So <laughs> first mod when you're broke, what do you do when you like race cars? When you like race cars? Spoiler? Mono oh, wiper. Mono wiper. <laughs> I would delete the passenger side wiper, move the driver side wiper over so it was like halfway up the windshield totally in the way of the passenger. That's really easy to do. All you do is like unscrew it yeah. and then move the hinge, there's, right? <laughs> there's a bit of work and no cost involved. No. That's what I think of when I see the mono wiper. I think of my youth as a broke auto enthusiast wanting to do something to my car. Of course we have a twin turbo V8 uh, buried under there. Yeah. Go and check out uh, Gabe's Seven Fig Entrepreneur, links in description. Podcast and Podcast. some vlogs. I'm gonna vlog this weekend. I'm going to New York, so for You're an going affiliate. To New York? Yeah, for an affiliate event. Oh, it's Affiliate Summit East. East. Yeah. yet is it no you know what it is mclarens protect the engines so when they're in neutral and you're not moving yeah. you actually can't rev it past 4,000 rpm those smart brits Ugh. we got some evening cruising to do oh yeah What a beauty. What a beauty. It's not mine. <laughs> I don't know why, but I love that baby. This is kind of like in the middle of nothing too fancy, but you have a really cool city line backdrop basically to end our vlog. I hope you enjoyed our tour of Vancouver, British. 
Okay, straight up, I didn't expect that. That scared the hell out of me. Okay, guys, smash that subscribe button. Thank you to McLaren of Vancouver for the car and the trust. You guys, if you need a car, you're in this area, please hit them up. 650S is for sale. $319,000. Now, that's Canadian. So you'll have to do the conversion in American if you're an American buyer and you're looking to get your car up here because there's a discount because of the exchange rate. But a whole lot of car for that money. Thanks for watching, you guys. I will see you in tomorrow's video, which I'm super excited about. So we'll be ripping a 720S. Peace.